Hi guys, Dustin here with another NASCAR diecast video. We are taking a look at our second Mustang, Sam Hornish Jr. The number 12 NASCAR Nationwide Series Alliance Truck Parks Parts Ford Mustang. As you recently saw in my previous video, I gave you a little preview by looking at this, and I did. So here's the other, so let's get started. So here, here it is, Action Racing Collectibles. They are still your choice of champions. Platinum Series, Penske Racing, NASCAR Nationwide Series. Now it's known as NASCAR Xfinity Series. 2013 is one of 1,764. And still the 20th anniversary, which was in 2013. Now is the 22nd anniversary. I ain't gonna waste any more time, so let's. That's the first sleeve. As always, it comes with this. No congratulations on your purchase, yada yada yada. I don't register my cast cars, I just collect them. So we remove the top piece off. And then. Car, Mustang, and a couple of times I screwed this, screwed this off, and the last time it stripped, screwed. But what? Well, the best thing about it, it actually improvises to, you know, use anything like about a quarter of a card or anything. Basically, I'm gonna use this little. So basically I'm using this little hard rock cafe as a screw driver to get it off. So I gotta loosen up one. And there we go. So here is our Sam Hornish Jr. Mustang. Alliance Truck Parts. Oops. Sorry, dropping stuff. <laughs> I like this little Mustang, and the one bad thing about this is that this front axle right here, it's all just one rod. Reason why I couldn't turn is because they did not add a steering rod to it, which is kind of a bummer, you know. I like diecast cars that you know that actually turn for a change. Kinda of like what a real car would do. So let's take a look. Here's the front of the hood. Basically Alliance truck parts. I've never heard of their sponsor before, which is a, they're pretty cool. You have the nationwide decal right across here, signifies that they are nationwide. Now these days you actually happen to see Xfinity across. Number 12, a car number we've never seen before. Last time we've seen that was last driver to race number 12 in the Sprint Cup race was Ryan Newman. SKF. In good fact, I actually got this diecast off of SKF's official website, their e store. And here's the back. The back basically has the same resemblance as a Ford Mustang. Basically, there are taillights and a little decal in the middle. Let's talk about what Lionel action did to their die cast cars especially for a Mustang added like a little turn signal decal right here and added a door decal which actually you know 
gives a resemblance of a of a Ford Mustang. The old decals, we got NASCAR and HY series, Coors Light, Comp, Mahel, Mog. I'm not sure what that one is. Mechanic Square, K and N. They also have others like Wirt, American Ethanol, what they use for their gas. Penzoil. Basically smaller sponsors. You look under here, you actually see that gold gold exhaust. Basically, it comes out through here. This actually blends in, which is real cool. I also have this little Ford license plate. It actually says number it says the number 13, since this is a 2013 Ford Mustang. The last Mustang I did was a uh, Trevor Bain number 16 Fastenal. Steven Siller Tones to Tower Foundations car. And this is actually our second nationwide car. I have not done a truck yet. So let's take a look at the engine. Underneath it says Alliance Truck Parts powered by Ford. Ford powered these engines. And there's your interior, there's your inside of what the engine looks like. Car rolls pretty good. I actually like the the yellow hub, yellow rims. Cause I did not mention this in the Brad Kozlowski one. That one had white. This one has yellow. I especially like this one because instead of the tradi of the traditional black, you have the yellow rims. That just pops out, making a huge huge difference against the against the tires. You got your front, which is basically your basic front lights, well front decals, and you have the little Mustang stallion galloping away. So, uh, where I got this off from? I got this off of SKF's official corporation and merchandise store. They had a huge blowout sale. This one cost about ten dollars. Brad Kozlowski one cost fifteen, which was an amazing steal. So, I went for it. You know, seized the opportunity, got it. Now those two cars are here. Heavy duty truck parts. And our diecast identification number is basically right here. Let's take a look and see what number it is. 902. Well, that's okay. It's okay. I still like this car. It's yellow, it's amazing. No black and yellow. I'm not thinking of the song. I got nothing else to say. Uh, my name is Dustin, and I will see you again.